Trees are important to me because they're really essential parts of um, urban nature. And if you live in an urban area that doesn't have trees, you can, I think you definitely notice the difference. You notice the impact when you go somewhere where it does have trees, has lots of greenery, you really notice a benefit in, in your day-to-day -day life. So I think trees are important for making our urban areas better places for us to live and somewhere that I want to live. Hi, I'm Kate Hand. I'm a PhD student at the Open University in the School of Earth, Environment and Ecosystem Science. Leaf area, the amount of leaves a tree has, is really important in determining lots of the um, benefits that trees provide us with. So things like how much air pollution the tree removes, how much it's able to photosynthesize and grow. So it's a really important metric that helps us understand trees and understand the benefits it provides us with but it's a very difficult thing to measure and so we don't have a good understanding of it, but we really want to, to be able to estimate the benefits of trees and be able to manage them better in the future. So we're plucking all the leaves from the tree so that we can get a true estimate of the total leaf area of the tree. We're gonna take a subsample of some of the leaves we're plucked today and we're gonna take those and we're gonna measure the area of them in a flathead scanner. And then we're going to take all of the leaves and we're going to put them in ovens and we're going to dry them. And then we're going to weigh them. And what we're going to do is we're going to relate the area of that sample to the mass of that sample and use that to get an area to mass ratio and then apply that ratio to the entire mass of leaves so we'll be able to calculate the total area of leaves on the trees. And then we're going to compare that to methods of estimating leaf area which don't involve taking down the tree or removing any leaves. So lots of different things like measuring the, the size of the trunk of the tree and relating that to leaf area, looking at how the light changes as it goes through the canopy and estimating leaf area like that, taking a 3D scan of the tree and estimating leaf area. So we're taking all of these methods and, and looking at how they compare to this true estimate of leaf area. So we've done a few trees before. We'll be able to estimate the total leaf area of um, some London plane trees that we've done in the past. So they've had a leaf area of about 140 meters squared or about between 20,000 and 30,000 leaves. So quite a lot. <laughs> <laughs> it's important that we understand the leaf area of a tree because it's a really important um, metric that we use to estimate the benefits that urban trees have. And we use these benefits to help us decide what trees we should be planting in the future, how we should be managing these trees. But right now we're kind of not able to do that completely because we don't have a good estimates of, of the leaf area of our urban trees. So this study is all about getting better information about how we collect leaf area data so we can collect more of this data and better inform uh, our management of urban trees in the future. So this is a really rare piece of work to do and it's really hard to, to get in place but we're really lucky to be able to do this here thanks to the Parks Trust which has been allowing us to use some of their trees which are going to be felled in the future for the study and a big thank you to them for their support in this. Also a massive thank you to all of the volunteers who've come in multiple times to help me pluck uh, leaves from these trees so this work wouldn't be done, couldn't be done without either of them so thank you very much.